patriotic step. That is how our senators in Virginia are reacting to President Joe Biden's decision to take his name off the November ballot. However, Republican lawmakers emphasize the decision is a sign of weakness in Biden's ability to lead. WDBJ 7's Kate Capadano spoke with lawmakers following the president's historic address. She has our recap tonight. I revere this office, but I love my country more. President Joe Biden emphasized that his love for the United States is what guided him to drop out of the 2024 presidential race. The historic address came Wednesday night, and Virginia senators continue to praise the president for his decision to step aside. Joe Biden has not only created a historic legacy for himself as a great senator, vice president, and president, but taking that patriotic step is something that I think Americans appreciate, and over time I think will come to even respect and appreciate it more. Both Senators Tim Kaine and Mark Warner have shared their enthusiasm and support for Vice President Kamala Harris, with Warner saying there's more energy behind her campaign. I got to tell you, I, I feel much, much better about Virginia. But I also think um, states that it appeared to be you know, potentially slipping away from President Biden, Arizona, Nevada, uh, uh, North Carolina, um, you, are going to be back in play. However, on the other side of the aisle, our Republican lawmakers say the move is a sign of weakness in Biden's leadership. Thursday afternoon, Congressman Ben Klein released a statement saying, while Joe Biden has prematurely ended his losing presidential campaign, his vice president, Kamala Harris, will try to convince voters to continue their destructive policies of open borders, inflationary spending, and endless wars. Regardless of who's at the top of the ticket, Voters are ready to reject the Biden-Harris agenda this November and elect to Donald Trump and J.D. Vance. Democrats have just 25 days until the Democratic National Convention, where they'll officially pick their candidate. In Roanoke, I'm Kate Capadano, WDBJ7.